Frank Vincent, you're now a Notts County player. How does that sound? Um, yeah, I'm obviously very, very buzzing to, to get the deal done. It's been a bit of an a anxious uh, few days um, trying to get it all sorted. But yeah, just buzzing to get it over the line, as they say. Um, yeah, just buzzing, really. It's such a big club. Um, and yeah, just can't wait to get started. Before we move on, can we just uh, take a moment to recognise your mum's dedication today? She She's <laughs> arrived here with you at Meadow Lane with a black and white handbag. Yeah, no, nah, um, obviously my mum's just as excited as me, really, and obviously I had to bring her along to the to the signing day because, yeah, she's just she's always been with me through my whole journey and looked after me in the low moments and enjoyed the highs with her. So, yeah, and I'm just buzzing she's here and she's just as happy as me. So, so yeah. For those of our supporters who won't have seen you play before, um, what, what sort of a player are you? Um, so I'm left-footed, I'm a midfielder. Um, I'd say I'm a technically gifted player uh, I like to pass the ball I like a combination one twos I like a yeah I, I do love a one two I think I've said it before um, and yeah so it's just kind of the way I play is I think going to be really suited to the way the, the gaffer wants to play here so lots of possession based football but not just that like I like to pass forward I'm not just here just to get the ball and pass it sideways and not take risks like I am think I'm a risk taker in the right moment um, and yeah just looking to get the ball pass forward start attacks and um, I still haven't got a career goal, so I'm just hoping to, to, to find that here and find some goal scoring form here, yeah. You mentioned Ian. Um, he said that he's been tracking your progress for some time. Um, just what has he said to you in, um, in helping you decide to come here? Yeah, so obviously I knew the interest was, was there from, from Notts County for quite a, quite a while. Um, and yeah, having spoke to Ian, I've actually been to the stadium like a, a month ago and had a look around and we had a good chat about football and just his... His way of playing is very suited to, to my play style. So that was always like a big factor of me wanting to come here and get this deal done because, yeah, like a lot of times you get managers that say they want to play like the right way and then you don't get a few results and it's just back to just lumping it. And I've been parts of different teams that do lots of different things. So, yeah, I think this is just the best place for me to, to you know, to really kick on, improve in training. And, and I think I've, I've watched a few interviews of other players and they're all raving about um, how good training is and how much they're enjoying it. So I just can't wait to be a part of that. And um, and yeah, just try and find my best form and, and, and do well for the team. You've played at Medellin once before, a 2-0 defeat in your Torquay days. What are your memories of that occasion? Yeah, so that was, we were on a great run of form at that moment. So you guys definitely put a stop to that. It was a... Uh, I want to say it was kind of a hostile atmosphere like you go out there and like you got fans like screaming at you and and yeah it was it was kind of like before the game even when you go out and look at the pitch I'm thinking this is a good stadium man this is this is this is it this is where I want to be so um yeah great great um obviously not great memories of that result but um of the stadium and the fans and the atmosphere can't fault it really and just hoping that um yeah we get the fans back in and and yeah I can't wait to just uh add to the positive emotions hopefully on your side that day uh, was Kyle Cameron who obviously joined us a week ago yeah um, how good will it be to have a familiar face when pre-season begins in 11 days time yeah no, definitely when I saw that I was quite shocked to be honest because um, I thought that Kyle Cameron's the type of player that would um, that is easily can play in the league you know so it really shows Notts County's like reach and their aspirations and um, it really kind of confirmed it for me that yeah this is where I want to go you know like I know I know the way he plays I think he's a very good player like solid in air like when when you're playing midfield and you have got him behind you you sort of like you, you you feel safe you know you feel comfortable with that so um, yeah uh, great great acquisition for the club and yeah it's, it's great obviously to have a familiar face um, around the, around the around the club so yeah.